So I used to think a package was only as valuable as the contents inside of it. But the funny thing about packages is that even when they're empty, they could still have your name or your number or your address. I say all of this to say, when I went to my frat brother's wake, his mouth was like an open envelope. Could hold neither words or letters. He was a fragile body, taped up and ready to be put in a box at the funeral. I watched his line brothers become his pallbearers. His pallbearers turned UPS on that day. I did not see his body shipped from church to hearse. I only saw his casket once delivered. This is supposed to be about how, how I prefer wakes over funerals. How when I saw him lying there, wrapped in kente cloth, my feet turned tombstones. This was supposed to be about how, how I can't give my nigga dap no more. How at his balloon release, more black boys cried than it rained. But as sad as it is to lose a brother, as sad as it is to lose a brother, there's something special about a black boy dying on his own. There's something special about a family getting to bury their son. There's something beautiful about them finding him in his bedroom instead of some street corner. If my nigga was truly heaven sent. My nigga was truly heaven sent and I'm glad that he finally got returned to cinder that unlike the boxes scattered across my bedroom floor, he is at peace and not in pieces. I praise the God who allowed my brother to be buried whole and not with holes, my nigga. My nigga got a funeral and not no candlelight vigil and you can't tell me that ain't no miracle. That there's a poster outside his sanctuary instead of some hashtag. Ain't it beautiful? How there wasn't no reason to march today. How today there wasn't no justice, no peace, just rest in peace. A black boy made it home, surrounded by everyone that loves him. So today we sing as high as our voices can carry us. We praise the God that molded him, the ground that holds him. We are thankful for every second we had with them, even though we may never have another. We, we are grieving, but we are grateful. We are hurting, but we are so, so happy. Because no matter what box he is in, no matter what box he is in, he will always be family.